Okay, we have all the solid brass door handles and hinges installed on all the doors. You can see how nice that looks. Let's go over to this one here. And brand new. We'll be back. Okay, this is a continuation of the doors. Let's go in the hallway. You'll notice that we got everything done, brand new. They sure look a whole lot better, don't they? Bathroom door. Finally, uh, the fourth bedroom. Makes a big difference. This house was built in 1986, which means that those door handles and hinges are about 35 years old. And there you have it. Okay, so here we're gonna replace the handles on all the doors, on all the cabinet doors with brass, brass handles, kind of to match up the, uh, all the doors in the house. We're doing all these two over here. 42 of them. And there you have it. We'll be back. Okay, so we took all the old door handles off and put brass door handles on. You can see how nice that looks. Get over here too. Makes a big difference. And then we also did the island. It's gonna match all the door handles and uh, all the doorknobs. The whole house will be brass, but the uh, doors and the, everything else will be polished brass. This is burnished brass. Anyway, there you have it. Okay, we're getting ready to spray out the ceilings in the living room and the little uh, front entrance over here. You'll see how we papered and taped all the way around the walls, the fans, all the way around. So we'll be back once the wall, the uh, ceilings are painted. So I just wanted to show everybody the skylight. It's like 150 degrees up there. Basically what I did was I just papered off the uh, skylight and uh, be like a million bucks after I spray it. I haven't sprayed it yet. But uh, I wanted to show everybody that, you know, we do paper all the floors, plastic floors, the uh, living room's already got one coat on it. Getting ready to put another coat on that when that dries. Do you see how we protect the kitchen with plastic? And there you have it. You'll see all the dark spots on the ceiling. That's still wet. We'll be back. Okay, so we got the first coat on the kitchen. Gonna put one more coat. Then we're gonna be done with the ceilings in the whole house. What a mission. And there you have it. We'll be back. Okay, all the ceilings have been done. You'll notice how all these light covers are done. The vent covers look like brand new factory finish. We're all set. Take a look at the living room. Brand new. There you have it. Okay, we want to uh, refinish these doors inside and out. Just wanted to show everybody what they look like before. We do a factory finish on them. I'm gonna sand them down. We're gonna apply semi-gloss enamel over them. And we'll be back. Hi Mitch, um, just wanted to show you this door, front door. You can see where they pressure wash that a little too much. I'm gonna see what I can do to fix it. This side over here is not too bad. But this side here, 
terrible. Anyway, I'll keep you posted. Thanks. Okay, I just wanted to show everybody that we used a, a wood filler to uh, kind of see if we can correct this door. I put it on there, and what we're going to do is we're going to sand that down now. And hopefully we'll be able to have a nice finish once we spray that door. It's going to be a nice semi-gloss. We'll be back. Okay, the outside doors are prepared. I uh, used a palm sander and I sanded up everything. Took all the uh, doorknobs off, sanded around the doorknobs. So when we put the new ones on, you're not gonna see a ring around the paint. But anyway, next step is to paper up, paper and tape, and then we're gonna spray the door. We'll be back. Okay, we're about ready to spray these front doors. Everything's papered off, prepped. I put a primer coat on the wood. You'll see that these doors look a whole lot better than they did before I patched them up. So let's go ahead and spray this and we'll be back. Okay, there we go. Outside is done. It's got two coats on it. It's a whole lot better. This is gonna dry a little bit darker because it's still wet, but looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. We'll be back. Okay, we're ready to spray the inside doors. The inside doors are in good shape because they didn't get pressure washed. But anyway, let's go ahead and spray this out and we'll be back. Okay, the inside of the doors is, are done. Came out beautiful. We even uh, sprayed inside the door jams on top up there because we had the paper and tape. And we're replacing those hinges, by the way, with polished brass. So the whole door will match with the new door handles. And there you have it. Another job by the New Image Restoration Company. Okay, the doors are done. Inside, these are the inside doors. You'll see that we've got the brass doorknobs and the locks. And everything is good. We'll be back for the outside. So here we are with the outside doors. These are finished. Look how nice those door handles look, brass door handles. And uh, down here, you're gonna notice that that wood is really bad. So what I did, this side over here is not too bad, but that side is. So what I did was I ordered brass plates, kick plates for the front doors. They'll be here today. So when I put them on, I'll be back for a final picture. And there you have it, front doors. Okay. Front doors are all done. All the brass hardware, including new hinges, all installed, looking good. Brass doorknobs. The door closes nice and easily. And you'll see that I put the brass plates on the bottom, kick plates. And there you have it. Beautiful refurbished set of doors. We'll be back for the next project. Okay, our next mission is these bathroom cabinets. They are unbelievable, unbelievably bad, but we're gonna give them a new image. I sanded them all up. There was a lot of loose paint. I'm gonna do the inside of that uh, cabinet in there where the plumbing is. And uh, We'll be back. Okay, these cabinets are done. 100% better. Let's take a look inside, see if I can get inside here. Bottom floor in there. I left the insides, the doors, the same color as the inside. But uh, definitely looks a whole lot better. I have to adjust those doors. This uh, drawer down here is kind of a little cockeyed, needs to be adjusted, but we'll do that once we get the brass uh, doorknobs on and the handles, we'll be ready to roll. And there you have it. Okay, just wanted to show everybody that the master bathroom cabinets are done. All we got to do now is put the brass knobs on 
and we'll be ready to rock and roll with the bathrooms. Another job done. We'll be back. Okay, here we go. Check it out. Master bath cabinets are finished. Looking like a million bucks. There you have it. We'll be back. And here we are with the uh, second bathroom. All refurbished. Looking a whole lot better than they did before. Brand new faucet. Looking like a million bucks. And there you have it. Okay, the master bedroom is done. <clears throat> Baseboards all gloss white. Brand new uh, wall switches. Doors all done. Gloss white. Brass doorknobs. Matter of fact, we need to replace uh, some of the wall covers, the switch covers, plug covers. Uh, we bought brand new ones because the old ones had paint all over them. But uh, there you go. Nice straight lines across the uh, ceiling line, all hand cut in. And there you have it. We'll be back. Wow, it sounds like we got a fire going today in our fireplace. Holy mackerel. Basically what we did was we cleaned out that fireplace. I painted that uh, black screen on the front and I bought a 24 inch smart TV. And I put that right in there and we've got fireplace galore. And there you have it. No wasted wood, no mess. Just a nice fireplace that crackles. There you have it. We'll be back.